What's up guys, it's X2Rabbit2X here, and today I'm bringing you another episode of Minecraft Modding Made Easy. Now today we're going to be making uh, custom tools and a custom material for those tools. Now, uh, I don't know, let's, where should we start? I guess, let's, I'm going to, I'm going to show you how to do one tool, because they're all the same. So I'm going to show you how to do one tool, and then I'm going to cut all of it out for the rest of the tools, because it's just boring typing, so... Let's do public static final item equals, um, oh, whoops, um, we got to call it blockium pickaxe, let's call it, let's do pickaxe first, equals new, um, item pickaxe, and now an, a pickaxe, item pickaxe, actually has two different um, parameters that you have to pass in. There's an ID, which is, if we're following numerical order, we're just going to do it 603, and then you also have to pass in a material. Now, on most tutorials, you'll see maybe you like the person pass in like an iron or diamond. Now, we're actually going to make our own material, so we're not just copying something else. So it would just equal, like, if we put in, uh, let's see, enum tool material dot, if we put in emerald, gold, iron, stone, or wood, it would just, the pickaxe would just act as one of these. But well, we're going to go ahead and make our own, so let's call this Blockium. And for now, you're going to have an error because we haven't done that yet. And, um, yeah. Oh, we also have to do a uh, set item name. Blah. That doesn't matter. So now we have that. Let's go down to our mod underscore Blockium constructor body. And let's make a pickaxe comment block. And let's go ahead and add our name. Um, blockium pickaxe and the name will be blockium pickaxe there we go um, we want to add in an icon so be blockium pickaxe dot icon index equals mod loader dot add override make sure to put in that slash at the beginning GUI Items that PNG. Make sure to put in PNG at the at the end. It's really important. And blockium pickaxe dot PNG. Now, before this tutorial, I went ahead and um, created a bunch of, uh, bunch of uh, custom icons. So here I have the sword, the spade or the shovel, the pickaxe, the axe, and the hoe. So yeah. Um. I can show, yeah, and I pasted it in Minecraft uh, MCP, bin, Minecraft, and they're all in here. So, yeah. So now that we have that, we have our custom, oh, whoops, I forgot to minimize Photoshop. Alright, so now that we have our little custom, custom texture, we want to go ahead and add a recipe. So, mod loader, we have a recipe template down here that I commented out. So we add recipe, new item stack. Now the class of what we want, which would be, uh, what can we actually just do? Blocky and pickaxe. Oh, okay, that works. So since we we are already in this class, we're already in mod .java, You only really need to put in um, the. Um, you only really need to put in the the object. You don't really have to put in the class because we're already in this class. I'll just figure that out so we could technically remove the mod blockium dot from there, but we'll just leave it as it is. So if if there's an item that you want to create with a recipe that is not in this class, so it's like if it's like if you want to create uh sticks, for example, then you would do item dot sticks or stick. So we have that one, and let's go ahead and new object, and bracket. Then we're going to want to make our recipe, so it would be three on, the, whoops, three on the top, comma. Then we're going to do a space, an X, space, um, and a, whatever. I just, quotation marks, that's what I forgot. <laughs> uh, then we're going to do another space, X, space. So it technically, these two are going to be sticks, and then on top it's three um, blocking ingots. So that works. 
uh, let's do character. You have to do, don't forget that comma, character dot value of. And now this only has to have one single quote because it's a char. So the value of um, that symbol is going to be mod. Well, we don't actually, I don't know, we don't have to do with mod underscore either in here because we're just passing in the object. So it's going to be blockium ingot. That works, okay. And then we're going to do character dot value of um, the X. Make sure to capitalize that. A comma item dot oops item dot sticks stick yeah stick um item dot stick is that it we don't need the ID okay and <coughs> no comma after that and make sure to have an ending brace ending parenthesis and then put a semicolon at the end um I mean that's pretty much it we just pretty much made a pickaxe. Now let's go ahead and open up the enum tool material Java, and you're gonna see something like this. Now this class is the original Minecraft class, and there is no method in Mod Loader to create custom materials. So we're gonna have to modify this. But if any other mod modifies this class, they're not gonna be compatible. So you gotta watch out for that. So let's go ahead and. Well, you see like all these declarations right here well there's a semicolon at the end so meaning all of this is one line of code so make sure that you see the semicolon right there just delete the semicolon put a um, comma at the end and enter and let's go ahead and create our material which is going to be called blockium and then let's give it a name blockium now with these number oops blockium and then don't end the parenthesis because that's those are the parameters so the first parameter is just pretty much the ID of the material. Like wood is zero and they go up one, two, three, four. Now let's give our blockium five, the ID of five. Now the next one is what can it mine? Or like what can it up to what material can it go? See like wood is zero and that can go up to stone, coal. Stone is one, means it can go stone, coal, and iron. Iron can go all the way up to diamond, em emerald, which is diamond, can go all the way up to obsidian, and then gold can only go up to stone and coal. So let's go ahead and make it three so it can mine everything like diamond can. Now the next one is the number of uses. Wood has 59 uses, diamond has 1,561 uses. So since we want to make something better than diamond, let's go to 2,000 uses. Now the next one right here is the speed of mining or, or like cutting down trees or whatever you're doing, whichever tool you're using. Wood is two, stone is four, etc. Gold is twelve, but it can only mine up to stone and only can yeah it can only mine up to stone. So let's make it twenty. T type in twenty F, so it's significantly faster than both gold and emerald. I mean diamond. Now the next number right here is uh that's like the base damage versus an entity. So like a wooden pickaxe would be weaker against an entity than a diamond pickaxe. Now when it comes to swords, what it what they do is actually they take this number plus the base damage of a sword, like let's say the sword base damage is four. So it would take this plus four to get the actual damage of a sword. For tools, it only takes this damage. So let's go ahead and set that, uh, since that's three, let's go ahead and set that to four. So it, now you know what, um, I don't know, let's, yeah, let's set it to four so the sword actually does more damage. Um, what, why is it, oh, okay. And then the last number is, it has something to do with enchanting. I'm not really sure yet, but yeah, I don't, I don't know. So let's go ahead and make it the same as diamond. Let's just put it to ten. And at the end of this line, you want to put a semicolon, ending this line of code. Don't forget that little comma right there and semicolon right there, because this will probably mess you up if you're going to end the line of code too fast. So now that we have declaration up there, all we need to do is scroll all the way down, and you'll see this, uh, this little all tool materials. And you just have to put a comma at the end of gold and just add in blockium. And no comma at the end. So let's go ahead and save that. 
and we're pretty much done. I mean, there's no errors in either one of our files. But uh, now what I'm going to do is actually um, create all the other tools off camera. I'm going to cut this because I don't want it. I don't know. I don't want to bore you with all the typing. So I'm going to add all the other tools off camera, and I will be right back.